Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm Christopher with Plan Your Truth and in today's video I'm doing a plan with me for the week of February 13th in my classic catch-all happy planner. Uh, full disclosure, I haven't done a plan with me in a little while because I just got back from my Disney trip not too long ago. So uh, vlogs, some of them are already up on my channel, more are to come. Um, but today is all about planning. So this is the week of Valentine's Day. I'm not a huge Valentine's Day person though, so I kind of went with a different vibe. I want to use this Live Love Posh. I love this book, Beautifully Lined. I do have a coupon code that will save you some money on your Live Love Posh order. So make sure to check that out. My affiliate link is always down below. But I love these lined florals and some of these quotes. And then I'm thinking we're going to bring in some of the green here from the sage book as well. So that's kind of what I want to, what I want to go off of. I do also have this pretty green washi tape. So let's just kind of dive in. This page kind of is falling out. So let's use this one. And I just want to like use up these, I love these big stickers. So let's use them. I think this one would look great right here in the sidebar. And I think it's going to kind of cover up this here. So I just want to go ahead and wipe this out. And then we'll put this down. I'm going to have this go kind of right over February here, but I'm okay if it covers it up a little bit. We'll just put that down right on the edge. And just like that, it takes up like the whole sidebar. And then this corner, I'm thinking, I do have some other like bushels. I was thinking this big corner could go down here. So I think let's start there. I just wonder if one of these other ones that are peeking off, if I kind of want to do that there. That's the only thing I'm wondering. But I do really like this. So yeah, let's do this. Um, we'll just do this over here on Sunday, right in this corner. I could have done it like going off the page. Oh, uh oh. Um, but I really do like the look just coming right from the bottom box here. I think these lined florals are just so pretty. Okay, so we at least have them on each side of the page now. <clears throat> Though there are some others if we want to. I think I do. I think I'd like something to come from up here and something to come from over here. Um, I'm trying to decide. This is a pretty little bouquet here. I could do that along the bottom. I think I like this here. And I don't want it to be that long. <clears throat> so I am gonna cut it right there. And we'll do this up here in this corner. Started to bend a little bit there, but there we go. And I'll save this because we could use that elsewhere. Okay, and then I want a little bit of something, I think, coming from the bottom here. Let's do, um, let's do this one. Oh, I just totally ripped that page. 
I also love the quotes that are on this set, so we definitely are going to bring those in. But I thought that this was pretty, you know, for Valentine's Day, even though I really don't celebrate Valentine's Day by any means. Um, so I'm not doing just like a pink lovey-dovey spread, but I thought a floral spread would be pretty. So we have some florals there. Um, I definitely want to bring in these quotes, but I don't necessarily know where yet. So let's look at this washi tape. I do like it. <clears throat> Maybe even just for like one spot on each side. So let's just try it. We could always peel it up once we get into the sage sticker book. But I think for right now, just to kind of change it up a little, let's go all the way to the edge here. This is, um, this washi cutter is also from Live Love Posh. Although, do I like that? Do I want it to go all the way across? No, that's kind of strange. Not strange, but I don't do that very often. Um, here, let me try this. So if we do it there on this side of the page, and then... here. I may cut it differently, but this is just kind of to start. I just think this is a, a pretty washi tape, so. And I could take it off the page, but I don't think I'm going to. Let's just do it right to there. All right, and we can always play around with that. Um, I love this quote. Well, I like a lot of these, so let's let's start here, maybe. Love yourself first, and everything else falls in line. Beautiful. And then let's pull this one. Life is a beautiful mess of tangled lines. I think we can do that one just right up here. Oh, it needs to move over to the left. Just kind of wish with that washi tape. I like that. Uh, I think I will use the others, but I want to go into Sage just so that depending on how like big the stickers are in here, we get to bring those in right off the bat. Okay. Um, do less, love more. I do like that. I think this was, the idea though was just to really use this for some colorful boxes. So I like this color. Just, I need to bring in the pink though too, since this washi tape is so green. It's like a lot of green on top of each other. Hmm. Maybe I don't want to bring in these colorful boxes. Let's see. I'm going to go to this colorful boxes book and see if there's a nice color that kind of matches this, like a deeper pink, because like that could work, but that's a little bit too light, I think. I think I'd like something a little bit darker, like maybe one of these. Yeah, this color looks nice, and I, I do like it with this green. So we could make this work, just kind of 
layer all of these with each other. So I'm going to layer this one here with the pink box on top there. Just going to see what the biggest boxes that we have with this color. Could do that one. Do this one. Thinking here, and then we'll do like some kind of green with that. Let's see, I hope there's some smaller green ones here. This could work. I think that's, yeah, that's pretty much the same green. Just to cover up that there. Okay, I do like the colors that we're working with. Uh, I just have the big colorful boxes book with the pink boxes off to the left, just so we can have a little more working room here. There's not a ton, a ton of these. Let's see, is that the same? Yeah, we could do this one. Um, I think I actually would prefer it here. Just to get that color down there. And it's a little too much like that. So let's see what else the sage book has. Um, I don't hate the idea of some of these arrows. Could kind of do a, a ladder effect. Yeah, let's go with that. Um, I have this on my hand. I want one other larger pink box for this size. So let's see what we have. I just really see this one, which has some gold, but I think we could make this work and just kind of layer this one. Here with this box layered there and we may try and play with those arrows again I think I like that better with them facing different directions um, so I'm gonna pull oh I really only have one more green arrow that we can play with on this side. Just to kind of do that. Okay, okay, okay. I do like the color mixing that we have going here. I know it's strange, but I kind of feel like I like that there, with, and we can do some bullet points or even stacking here. Hmm. It's an interesting, I, li I like the ladder stacking situation. So we could do one here. I just don't like that. So I think I'd rather it if this will move over to the left. So if this is here more on like Friday, Saturday, and then we'll do some stacking boxes here. Do one more pink one. Let's 
thinking maybe one more green one here. Hmm, I like this a lot. Okay, so I think we're done with boxes. So I could, because we did have a little bit of gold here. So I do kind of want to bring in um, something gold over here. It could just be like a little to-do banner maybe. If I wanted to do, oh, no, I was thinking that that could be right with the lines there. Hmm. Because I feel like that looks weird. Just kind of floating in space by itself. No, I don't like that shape. I don't want to bring in one of these quotes because we have plenty of quotes with that other page. Um, oh, I could. Let's just try this. If we did that instead there. Although, no, to be honest, I think it's really elegant with just those two colors. I really like that. Um, you barely even see that gold, so I'm not gonna like, be super upset if I don't find something gold for over here. Yeah, I think I'm actually going to leave that. I do want to add in these other two quotes, if we can. Every single line means something. I love that. Let's see. Because one of them is going to go here and one is going to go there. So let's pull the other one just to see which looks best where. Because this is a, a really long one. Okay, I think we're going to do this one here. And this long one. Right, like that. All right, bullet points is the last potential thing here. Um, it just looks so pretty right now that like I don't wanna mess with it. So I may not do bullet points. I think we could add just a few little uh, like elements here if we want to. Like, for example, these blue flowers. If I wanted to add stuff in the middle of the page, like that would look cute there. And no, I don't think I want to do that. Because even though there is a little bit of blue on the page, I think that makes it like a, a main color. And I just like the little bits of it. Little bits of it. So you know what? We're going to leave it here. I feel like usually I try and add a little bit more. But I like, I like where this is looking right now. So we are going to leave this here. Thank you all so much for watching. Uh, I'm going to pop it back on the discs. I feel like I kind of got away from doing that. So let's pop this on the discs and see what we're working with here. But how have you all been doing? I know it's been like a hot minute. Disney, that trip just took a lot out of me, but I had the best time. So I hope you guys are enjoying those vlogs. Um, but that is all for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please hit that thumbs up button. If you want to see more of my videos, you can hit that subscribe button. And remember to plan your truth so that you can live your truth. Thanks so much.